Sí, es, es preocupé. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Good evening. How are you today? Fine. How was your working? You're working, Maria? I, I'm worrying. Oh, you're I'm worried. Yeah, I'm worrying for cor, cor, vir, cor, no, cor, coronavirus. The cor, coronavirus. Coronavirus. Yes. I am not working. Yes. I, yeah, it's a it's a difficult situation for most people. Yes, difficult. Yes, so we just have to wait and see what happens. Uh, yeah. So what what kind of activities do you do in your house right now? Now that you're free. In my and um, my house, I. I clean my house. I wash the dishes. Uh -huh. I, I cook cooking for my my little my son and my daughter. And and regar mi jardín. Okay. I water my garden. Water my garden. Yes. Do you like and plants? What? Do you like plants? Uh, yes, I like plants. Do you have I only like plants or do you have trees also? Uh, repeat, please. Only plants or do you have trees in your garden? Uh, three, uh, only only plants. Only plants. I I have very very small. Uh, a small uh, um garden. Uh, no, um cactus cactus oh. small cactus small uh -huh. cactus yes. Cactus yes. are nice. I I have four orchids. Yeah. This is beautiful. I imagine orchids I, I, are, are I, nice. I like the the yeah, the plants. Good, good. It's my are life. You, good. Pamela, what about you? What kind of activities are you doing at home right now? I'm doing home office and some, a little about the exercise. Okay. And clean my house, my room, watch some television, and sleep okay. a lot. <laughs> <laughs> and, but it's becoming boring. Yeah, yeah. I think that the first days people enjoy it, people feel like vacation, but you know, day after day you have exactly the same routine. Yes, and but it gives some anxiety. Yes. Yeah, people get anxious. Yes. Melvin, how are you? Hi, good evening everybody. Fine. Hi, Melvin. Hi. Are you working normal or are you working or, or are you staying in your house, Melvin? Uh, no, I stayed in my house since last Monday, teacher. Okay. And what activities are you doing in your house? Um, first, in the morning at, at 6, I was watering the, the grass. Okay. And take a shower, uh, take a lunch, and connect until 12. 12. Yes, later I have a lunch and connect again until 5. 
Now, when you say connect, what exactly do you mean? With my, um, I had a, a meeting uh, almost 24 seven in Zoom with my company. Okay. <laughs> and I checked my emails and WhatsApp too. All right. In cell phone, of course. So you are very uh, connected and communicating. Over teacher. <laughs> yeah. Email, Zoom, WhatsApp, cell phone. Cell phone, yes. Okay, good. Great. Yeah. Do you use um, text messages or only WhatsApp? Uh, for the customers, only WhatsApp. Yeah. Yeah, I think that text messages are a little bit obsolete, you know, like people usually use WhatsApp. Yes, it's more, it's more comfortable. comfortable. Yeah, yeah, comfortable, because convenient. Smash uh, documents and, and text. Exactly. Yes. Do you remember in the past that you had a limit of words for one message? I don't know, uh, 30? Mm, I don't remember. 30, 35, 40. But people literally, they counted the words in the message so you don't pay extra. Yes. <laughs> That's the Salvadoran yes. economy. <laughs> yes. Okay, anyways, today is the 26th of March. We're almost finished with the month. We have one more week of classes and um, here we are. This is our last day of the week, our last session of the week. Um, yesterday we were practicing um, with the simple past tense. Um, what is the function of the simple past tense? What's the function? Um, describe uh, uh, past activities. Very good. Describe past activities. Finished activities. Uh -huh. um, what's the auxiliary that I use to make negative sentences? Negative? Negative. Didn't. didn't, didn't. What if I want to make a question? Is it, is it, um, if I want to make a question? You use did plus the, the verb in the face form. Very good, very good. If you make a question, you use did and the form of the verb stays base form. Now, what happens when the information is positive? Uh, we use uh, the verb in past form. Good. We use the verb in the past form. Do we use regular or irregular? Both of us. Both. Exactly. Both of so you can use regulars, you can use irregulars. Um, what is the main characteristic of regulars? Deposit. At the end, they you finished the ED. But, and, and what is the function of ED? Change the verb in, in past. Very good. ED indicates that the verb is in past. And ED indicates that the verb is regular. Now, what is irregular? The verbs that are completely changed when Good. you use the past form. Exactly. So when you use irregulars in it past. Change from present the, to past. Okay. So when we change them from present to past, they change the form. So ED doesn't exist with irregulars. Any questions there?
So if I ask you, what did you do today? How would you answer that question? What did you do today? Vladimir, what did you do today? So, any in my house? In, so, did you watch TV? Yes, I did watch TV and, and listen to music. Good. Did you cook? No. <laughs> why, why not? <laughs> did clean you it, clean it? Cleaned. Clean. Cleaned it. Did you water the plants? What? Pardon? Did you water the plants? Did you water the plants? Uh, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay, what about you, Melvin? What did you do today? Yes, I wear my my grass in my, ah. my general plants in a lot of my cactus collection. Oh, so you like cactus like Maria? Yes, I really like plants, but especially cactus. I am exactly the same. I like plants in general, but I think my favorites are cactus. Yes, yes really nice. I have like five different types of cactus in, in my house. Five? I have, I don't know, 38? I imagine. Ooh, nice. Yeah, pe pe people have collections. People take cactus very serious. Yes. Yeah, that's good. And do you buy the cactus when they are babies or do you plant them? What is the process? Both. I, I bought uh, some, in some cases, I transplant the little, the little ones. Uh -huh. And I receive a cactus for gift too. Okay, good, good. Is yeah. My cactus. Oh, oh my that. goodness. My cactus <laughs> is, is very, it's very nice. Yes, that's good. So those are medium size. Sí. I I little I I have one hundred one hundred. Oh cactus. my god! Yes. Wow. I, I have collection. Uh huh. Do you sell cactus? Yes. Do you sell uh, them? Uh, no, no. O only for collection, only, only for, for pleasure. Only collection, uh-huh. Okay. Uh-huh. Good, good. All right, what about you, Pamela? What did you do today? Pamela, can you hear me? Oh, Cecilia, can you hear me? Okay, what about the others? Can you hear me? Melvin, Vladimir, Maria? Yes, yes. Okay, yes. good, yes. very yes. good, all right. Okay, so just remember that the simple past tense is one of the most important tenses in English. And you use them all the time, all the time, all the time. All the time. Yes. Yeah. A cada rato ocupa el simple pass. All the time. All the time. All the time. Yes. Okay. So let's go here. Remember that we finish next um, next week. Do you see the image? Yes. Yes. Okay. How many people Four. are there? Three people. Three people. What are their Three names? People. What are their names? Kelly. Kelly, Robert, Robert. and Erin. 
No remember. Erin. Erin. Okay. So we have Kelly, Robert, and Erin. Okay. I need a volunteer to read the story about Kelly. And pay attention because all the information is in past tense. Volunteer for Kelly? Me. Okay, yes, Maria, thank you. I had a great weekend. I went to my be best friend, Helen's wedding. She got married at home. All her friends and family went. She looked as she fantastic. looked she looked fantastic she wore a beautiful dress after the ceremony yes her uh, her parents served 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 serves a wonderful meal i am i'm really happy for her and i really like her husband. All right, good. Acuérdese que el verbo like significa caer bien y también significa gustar. Gustar, ajá. Uh -huh. En este caso uh -huh. le está diciendo me cae bien su esposo. No es que no es que le diga que le gusta. Ah. Okay. Bueno, que puede ser también, verdad, pero. <risa> Depende no creo del que, contexto. Que ajá. Sea. No creo que se lo diga tan abiertamente en ese sentido. But anyways, okay, uh, so how do you say, usted me cae bien? I like you. I like you, exactly. I like you. Pero ahora, cuando ya le empiezan a ver con ojos diferentes y todo, y le dicen, you know what, I like you. Ahí él le dice, me gustas. Okay, any questions about the first reading? No. Questions about vocabulary or pronunciation? Fantastic, beautiful. Serve is uh, served. Served. Yes. What is served? What is what's the meaning of served, people? Yo entiendo en el contexto que es como ofrecieron o sí, sí. sirvieron, pero más ofrecieron. Sí, sirvieron una comida maravillosa, pero tal como dice ella, ya en español se oye mejor que diga ofrecieron. Sí. Ah, ok. Y ese ofrecieron no es de que solamente lo enseñaron, sino que prácticamente lo sirvieron. So, how do you say, ella se casó? She got married. She got married. Got married. She got uh, married. En su casa. Ajá, ella se casó en casa. casa. What is the past tense of look? Look, vieron. Sí, fantastic. The past tense of look? Look. Looked. Looked. Yeah. Very good. Look. Ella se miraba fantástica. I, I have a question. Yes, uh, Pamela. What, what is the past tense of listen? Listened. 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 So, si yo le digo, mire, ¿qué hizo hoy en la mañana? Oh, I only listened to music. Listened. Listened. Listened, listened. Yes, okay. listen to Thank music. You. Sure. Any other questions about the first uh, reading? Uh, the the word uh, uh, word word yes word a uh, beautiful dress. Ella se veía fantástica. Okay, ella se veía fantástica. Se puso un vestido bonito. Okay. Word word is the past tense of wear. Que significa uh -huh. ponerse uh -huh. o usar. Sí, wear. Uh -huh. Okay. All right. Any other questions? No? No. Question. Okay. I need a volunteer with Robert, please. Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank you, Pamela. 
Robert, I had an awful weekend. My friends and I went to a rock concert. I had a terrible time. It took three hours to drive there. I didn't like the music at all. And after the concert, and after the concert, and ended? Our car broke, uh, ended or car broke down. I called my parents and they came and got us. We finally got home at 10 this morning. I am so tired. Good. Excellent. Thank you. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. Any questions about pronunciation or meaning? As you can see, all the information is in past tense. All the information is in past tense. What is the, how do you pronounce the past tense of end? Ended. Ended. How do you pronounce the past tense of call? The past tense of call. Called. 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 Yes. I called my parents. Called. I called my parents. Mm -hmm. And they come and go. All right. Like any me. any questions about um, Robert? This morning, I am tired. Ahí está la foto de Robert y la foto de Kelly. And now it's time to read Aaron. Who Aaron. is Aaron? Aaron. Volunteer for Aaron? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you, Melvin. Aaron, I have an inter interesting weekend. I went camping for the first time. My friends took me. We left on Saturday and drove to the campsite. First, we put up the tent. The, the tent. Then we built a fire, cooked dinner, and told stories. We got up early on Sunday and when finished, I caught a fish. I didn't really like camping, but I learned a lot. Okay, very good. Questions about meaning or pronunciation? We left on Sunday and we draw. draw. How do you pronounce the past tense of cook? Cook. Cooked. 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 And what is the past tense of learn? Learn. Learned. 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 Yes. And teacher, what is drove? Drove is the past tense of drive. Drive. Drive is drive. present, drove is drive. past. Drove. Drive, drive. drive. What is the present of had? Uh, has. Have or has. What is the present of went? Go. 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 Took. Take. Left. Uh, left. Uh, left. We left on Saturday. Nos fuimos el sábado. Left is in pass. What is the present form? If you leave me now, leave. Going. Left, leave. Drove. Drive. Drive. Put. 
Put. Put. It's the same. <laughs> Built. What is build. the movement of build? Build. Build. Cooked. Cook. Cook. Got up. What is the Get present? Up. Get, up. Get up. Get up. Went. Go. Go. Caught. I caught. I caught a fish. ¿Qué dice en español? I caught a fish. Ajá, atrapé un pescado. So the past, the present of caught is catch. Catch. And the present of learned. Learn. Learn. Yeah. All right. Okay, any questions about the reading before you start doing the speaking? Preguntas? Questions, questions? Okay, I guess not. Okay, so right now, you guys are going to be working in pairs. Um, let's see this here. Can you send the image? Sure. Right now. Si quiere capturarlo en su pantalla, ahí está. Y si no, pues aquí se lo mando ahorita por WhatsApp. Just give me a second. <laughs> da, 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 da. Pass. Okay. Pass. Share. Right here. This linger I come Okay. Okay, did you receive the image? Yes. Okay, fine. So can somebody read the instructions for number one? Write the simple pass part of the verb. Ok. ¿Qué es lo que va a hacer? Pasarlos al tiempo, a conjugarlos al tiempo pasado. Some of them are regular, some of them are irregular. So in the first exercise, solamente va a decir el verbo en su forma pasada. In part two, what you need to do, siempre va a trabajar con el mismo grupo en el número uno and you will decide if the verb is regular or irregular. Como no lo podemos escribir, usted solamente lo va a uh, platicando. Part three, change the sentence into negative or the question form. Ahí les indican si quiere, por ejemplo, la letra A tiene que ser la negativa. La B tiene que ser la positiva. Y en la parte 4, part 4, you have to complete the sentences with the past form in parentheses. Entonces, el verbo que tenemos en paréntesis es el que usted va a ocupar para que la oración o la pregunta tenga sentido. Are the instructions clear? Yes. Ok, okay so vuelvo a repetir, en la parte 1 solo pone, solo conjuga el verbo en su forma pasada. En la parte 2, esos mismos verbos, usted va a decidir si es regular o irregular. Y en la parte 3, vamos a hacer según lo que nos piden. En algunas son preguntas, en otras son negativas. Y en la parte 4, pues vamos a ocupar el verbo que está ahí en paréntesis. So I'm going to make the groups right now. So you guys can work in pairs. 
and here we go. You. I'm great. Hi. Trabajamos en la. Oh no. Sí, sí, sí. Okay. En la primera parte es de... La parte 1. Sí. Where the simple pass from of the... El primero... What is the pass meat? Meat. Met. 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 M-E-T. 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 Only, only e, e. Only one e. Only one e. e. Only one e. Okay. E. The pass go. Is going. Ah uh ah. -uh. Ah uh, no. Going is present, brother. Yeah, it's Simple. present continuous. Meet um, is. Reunimos, o nos reunimos. Exactly. No. O conocieron. Nos conocimos. Uh, sería que... Meet. 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 Uh -huh. Meet. Uh -huh. go, go is here. The past is when. When? Uh -huh. <gasps> is I confused. No. Is where? Is where? Okay. What what number are you doing? Uh, go. Yeah. Go. The past. The past. The past four is uh, when. Exactly. Yes. Uh -huh. Past four is when. Yes. Uh -huh. Is is the try? Hace hace poco dijimos que era draw. Exactly. Draw. draw. Okay. Sleep. Uh, uh, sleep. Sería slept. Sleep. Sleep. No. Slept. 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 Okay. Uh, eh, teacher. Yes. The, the simple pass meet is met, right? Yes. Only one e. Okay. And uh, sleep is slept. Yes. Slept. S L E P T. S L E P T. Okay. And think. I don't know. Think. 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 Eric, do you remember the past tense of think? Um, no, teacher. The past tense of think is thought. Thought. Okay. Uh huh. Thought. So, how do you say pensé que era sábado? I thought it was, it Saturday. was Saturday. Exactly. Uh, is T O U G H T? No. T H O U H T. Thought. There's no G? Yeah, there is G. T H 
O U G H T. Mm -hmm. Right is. Sí. Sí. Fly es uno Flight. de los verbos que cambia, ¿verdad, teacher? Uh, what number? What number? Fly. Uh, fly. Okay, let me ask you. Is fly regular or irregular? Irregular. Irregular, exactly. Irregular. The fly. past tense of fly is flu. 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 Okay. F-L-E-W. Okay. F? F-L-E-W. Ah, uh, okay. In... In B, pass the past. Okay, what? Okay, what is the past tense of B? B was was and the past. Okay, so so the past tense of B has two forms. What are the two forms? Was and was. Exactly. Was, were. Were. Was, was, were. Was, were. Okay. Yes. Was, were. Is sink. The was, were. The sink. Sing. Song. Sing. sing. What is the past tense of sing? The past is song. Ah uh ah. -uh. Vladimir no. Nelly. What is the past tense of sing? Sing. Sing. S a n g. Sing. Sing. How do you say cantamos toda la noche? Singing? Sing. No, what is the past tense of sing? We sing. I was singing. Always. Okay, listen, listen. What is the past tense of sing? We sing. We sing. We sing. We sing. We sing. All night. Exactly. Night. We sang all night. Okay. Uh huh. We sang all night. I think it's co collected. Yes, collected is right. Collector. Paint. Painted. Painted. No. Sing is irregular. No. Paint. Oh, paint. Yeah. Paint? What's the past tense of paint? Painted? Yes. Painted. Um, Invent. Invented. 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 Sam, good. Teacher. Yes, sir. We have audio problems with Cecilia. Oh, my God. She can hear me and 
she can use the microphone. So exactly. And we have a, exactly. A, a chat, a, a private, private chat. Oh, okay. So let me move you. Okay, give me a second. No problem, teacher. Right. Friday. Okay. Right. 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 Cried. 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 Hold. 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 Yes. Okay. Uh huh. You guys finished with the first part? Only yes. the first part. Okay. Okay. Let's go back to the main session. Okay. Okay. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Okay, so let's do it all together. Todos lo vamos a hacer juntos. Vladimir, what's the past tense of meet? Era... Híjole. Eh... Met. Exactly. Maria, what's the past tense of go? Went. Yes. Nelly, what's the past tense of drive? Drove. Eric, sleep. Eric, are you there? Okay, Pamela. Hi. What's Hi. The, what's, what's the past tense of sleep? Slept. Melvin, think. Thought. Very good. Vladimir, ride. Row. Good. Maria, come. Come. The past tense of come. Come. The past tense. Past tense, count. Come. No. Come no. is irregular. Come. Come. No. Come is irregular. So it's, irregular. In, it, it's impossible to use ED. So the past tense of come is came. Came. Uh -huh. came. came. How do you say yo vine ayer, Maria? I came. Yesterday. Very good. I came yesterday. Nelly, fly. Fly. Is it regular or irregular? It's regular. Irregular. Oh, irregular. it's flow. Ah, uh, flu. Yes. Flu. The past tense of fly is flu. flu. What about flu. me, Eric? Um, the past tense of B. Anybody? 
do you remember what we mentioned when? yesterday? Was and were. Was, was were. Very good, Eric. Was were. Was were. Pamela, yeah. sing. Sang. Sing. Sing, sang. Sing. Sing, sang. Melvin, collect. Collected. Collected. Very good. Vladimir, paint. Paint. Painted. Very good. Maria, invent. Invented. Invented. Very good. Nelly, Invented. stop. Stopped. Good. Perfect. Eric, hug. Hug. I, I don't think Eric can hear me. Pamela, what's the past tense of hug? Hugged? Yes, hugged. Cecilia and Eric have problems with audio ahorita. Uh, Melvin, uh, jump. Jump, jump. Good, jump, very good. Vladimir, see. So. Good. Maria, become. Okay. Become. Ben. Became. Became. Very good. Nelly, fight. I think it's fight. Fight is irregular. Uh, <laughs> so what is the past Hello. tense of fight? Fight. Anybody? The past tense of fight? Fault. 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 Yes. How do you say my ties on Pelio Noche? My Tyson fought oh. last night. Exactly. My Tyson fought last night. Can you write? Sure. Ahorita se lo mando al chat. Uh, in the in the past tense of cry. Right. Pride. Cried. 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 How do you say lloré en la película? I cried in the movie. Uh -huh. I in the, in the big. Uh, in the movie. I cried movie. during the movie. Ya han llorado viendo una película. Yes. Yes. Uy, <laughs> Coco. Oh, my. Coco. Okay, Coco. All right. <laughs> Any questions in part one? Como usted puede ver, son verbos que se ocupan todos los días y tiene que saberse su forma pasada. ¿Alguna pregunta sobre el significado de esos verbos? Ok, now we go to part three. En la parte 3 tenemos que hacer de un solo la negación o la pregunta. Part 3, change the sentences into negative or interrogative forms. And play tennis yesterday. ¿Cómo lo voy a negar? ¿Cómo lo voy a hacer negativo? I didn't play tennis yesterday. Yes, and He didn't play tennis yesterday. What about letter B? Your friends ate some hamburgers last night. Are you friends? Past you, tense. Past tense. Your friends. Your friends ate some hamburgers. Did your friends eat some hamburgers last night? Yes. Did your friends eat some? Hamburgers last night, como lo está preguntando, como lo está preguntando, tiene que ocupar el verbo did. Y como ocupamos did, entonces el verbo se queda en su forma base. What about letter C? It's negative. Nelly, can you do letter C? Alex in praise. Um, didn't. Did it Alex and Chris were in Rio in October? Good, very good. Alex and Chris 
weren't or were not. Porque el ejemplo le dice, Alex y Chris estuvieron en Río en octubre. Entonces, como lo vamos a hacer negativo, usted tiene que decir, no estuvieron. So, what is the negative of were? Were not. not. What is the contraction oh. of were not? Weren't. 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 No se puede decir, didn't go. ¿Cómo no? Sí lo puede decir, pero como aquí en este ejercicio estamos ocupando el verbo to be, nos tenemos que quedar en el verbo to be. Pero claro, en la vida real usted puede decir, Alex and Chris didn't go. Pero ya estaría diciendo, no fueron, cuando el ejercicio nos dice, no ah, estuvieron. estuvieron. Ajá. Pero sí, okay. in a real conversation, you can say didn't go. And it's good. And letter D, Bettina read a whole book yesterday. Ahí lo dan positivo, pero usted lo tiene que cambiar a pregunta. ¿Cómo será? Did Bettina read a whole Did Bettina read? Ajá, did Bettina read? A whole book yesterday. A whole book. Yesterday. Hey, did Bettina read a whole book yesterday? Uh huh. Any questions there? Preguntas? Teacher, yo en el número en la letter A uh -huh. dijeron didn't 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 Anne play the tennis. Algo así lo escuché. O sea, como que usaron el did y el verbo en pasado. No. O no sé si estoy equivocado. Lo, lo correcto, y la persona que lo dijo, lo dijo bien. Eh, como lo vamos a hacer en negativo, usted va a decir, And didn't play tennis yesterday. We used didn't. Okay. Y el verbo se queda en su forma base. No le vamos a poner el ed porque ya ocupamos el auxiliar. No, oh, es que yo escuché que dijeron el verbo en, en pasado. No, but it's, it's, it's good. The, the structure that they answered was good. Okay. Any questions in that exercise? Su tarea va a ser responder toda la página. Y hágalo de manera escrita para que practique más. Entonces, ya hicimos el 1 y el 3. Ahorita usted lo que va a hacer, lo hace por sus propios medios y lo escribe. Y lo mismo hace con el 2, con el 4 y con el 5. Y ahí lo vamos a... ¿Ya? ¿Ah? ¿Yes? No. Monday. Monday. Ya. Yeah. Monday. Yes. Okay. Hasta el lunes. Mañana no hay clase. Okay. okay. Any questions before you go to sleep? No, teacher. Okay. So thank you very much for your time. Stay safe. Have a nice weekend and take care of your family and take care of yourselves. Thank you. Thank you. Nice weekend. Nice weekend. Nice weekend. See you. See you.